Are you looking for the next craft beer to drink? Well, maybe Consecrator Doppelbach by Bell's Brewery is the one for you. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. And for Fat Tuesday, we are going to drink Consecrator Doppelbach. Jessica picked this Did up. Did you tell him how much it was a single? Oh, uh, yeah. Nope. Brown. Nope. Br Brad, brown. <laughs> Two ninety nine. There you go. At Bell's, right? No. No? I bought this from Drake Party Center because okay. I never went to Bell's to get the yeast. Okay. So. Um, Packaged on 131.18, so less than a month old. As of right now, 8% ABV, not sure about the IBUs. They are not on untapped. And I'm pretty sure the, yeah, the bottle just has 8% ABV. Okay. I don't know if I, I don't remember if I like Dapplebox. Do you like Dapplebox? I don't remember. Don't I think I've your... only had a couple of them. Okay. So. All right. I don't, <clears throat> I don't know. Tannish head. Yep. All small bubbles. About three quarters of a finger of head color amber color very clear i can see all the way through it some bubbles coming up not very many would you say caramel or molasses color i would say caramel that's like the color of molasses, molasses in the, in the is jar. a, a lot darker. darker a little bit darker okay smell this is i like the smell yeah, I'm getting some caramel, maybe some like toasted bread in there. Sweet. It smells like, to me, it smells like a best brown, but a little bit sweeter. Yeah. Caramel, a little bit of toffee, some toasted bread okay. is what I get. No alcohol. Okay. Okay, drink. That's good. It's a different taste. Yeah. It's a different taste for what I like. It's not smoky. It's not, I don't think it tastes too toasted, but I like it. Like uh, a sweet caramel toffee up front. Yeah. Then it kind of goes back into a toastiness. A little toasted bread and then there is some alcohol like I get some alcohol in the back oh, of I it get too much but it's almost okay. it's not as sweet but it's it, it almost reminds me of if you've ever had melted caramel like when you first put it in your mouth and that caramel it that's caramel sweetness that's kind of what it is to me okay Have they ever released this? I not that I know of. I don't remember seeing two goats on a bottle. <clears throat> it's kind. It's kind of good. It's not what I was expecting. I really had no idea what I was expecting, to be honest. But this is using um, their house lager yeast. Okay. Caramel molasses. I wouldn't. I. I don't think it's. I'm getting molasses. I think, if anything, molasses is used to help get the ABV up. Okay. But I don't think it tastes like, you know, a syrup or molasses. No, I don't think it's that sweet. I think it's, I think it's well-balanced. Well-balanced. I don't know what other what other beers I've had that are Doppelbox to yeah, know, like, how I to can't. compare. But this is good. Yeah. And this is for Fat Tuesday. Yep. Um, for a Fat Tuesday release. So, um, how do you say the, what do they, what do they eat on Fat no Tuesday? I don't know. Uh, the donuts. Poskies? Po Pot. See, you oh, don't know how to no. Anyways, this, I don't know if this would be good with one of those, but. I would go with a 4.25 out of 5. <laughs> Again, okay. I haven't had a lot of doppel box, but this is something I could pick up a six pack and drink it all. Um. I wouldn't say I could crush them just because I can taste that alcohol and back there. I'm not getting any alcohol. Okay. So I wonder if 
But maybe you have a sore throat or something. A little bit like a raw. No. It's not. It's I'm still not there. getting any of it at all. Oh, I get some. Um, I think that this would be good for fall beer. Yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, a winner, I could see a winner, but I think if it was really going to be a winner, I would like some winter beer. I would want, like, some spices in there, maybe. Oh. But what what are you going with? I think a four and a half. Four and a half? Yeah, I would drink it again. Okay, 18 Good. of my friends have rated it average 3.99. Okay. 23,000 ratings, 3.79. Um, but again... Uh, I really liked it. It could, I, I hate that. how untapped and all these places do this. I think they should separate, like the 2017, 2018, 2016. I think they should separate all the those. Versions. Because they do change. Yeah. Um, David saying dried fruit. Yeah, but when's the date of that? Yeah, one, uh, two, one, seventeen. So he's so drinking last year's last was year's different version. than this yeah. year's. But this... I liked it. I don't, there's so no So obviously this isn't the first time they released it if you okay. had it at the beginning yeah. of 2017. Yeah. And I didn't, I didn't know. Yeah. I don't remember ever seeing it. And I look for beer all the time. But I would recommend this to anyone that likes a... Bread I would, fruit rich. If you like, I would say if you like amber ale or the best brown, you would like yeah. this. I, I That's why say, I like it, yeah, I think. If you like ambers or maybe browns. I would say know, be, br Bell's in particular, best yeah. brown. Okay. Bell's best brown or Bell's amber ale. Okay. You would yeah. like this because that's, I think. But yeah, go, to go further, most ambers, most browns, you're going to start pushing that caramel toffee. But it's good. Yeah, it's 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 a good one. Mm-hmm. Cool. Yeah. Cool. So that'll wrap up our Fat Tuesday review. <laughs> and until next time, I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. Happy brewing. If you like this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button and thumbs up and check out some of our other videos.